feeling really weird today, like super weird, like weird like I felt before I went into the hospital. And I think this has sort of been progressing over the last week or so. Sit down, babe. You look like you have a freaking mustache. <laughs> oh. And um, yeah, I don't know what the fudge is going on in my brain, but it's like I can feel it. I can feel... I can feel <laughs> like switches going off in my brain and I don't know what's happening to me and it's freaking me out and uh, I have to go see my counselor today and I don't know what she's going to make of this. I know it sounds like I'm manic right now but it like keeps flipping on and off like all throughout the day. <laughs> Just, like in five minutes I will probably be totally comatose like sitting on the ground, unmoving, <sighs> staring at a dot off in the distance. Like, <laughs> I don't know, I don't know, like the way I feel lately, it's, I don't even know how to describe it, it's like, um, it's like sensory overload, like I don't know if other people with bipolar get this, um, but yeah, it's like sensory overload, I don't know how else to describe it, like, I went for a walk the other day and it's like everything around me, I feel like I feel like I'm absorbing the world, like I'm taking in everything in the world and I am a part of everything in the world. My soul is floating in the infinite universe and <sighs> I split apart and pieces of me go here and there and they soak into everything. And I don't know what to do about that. <laughs> I don't know. It's like everything melds into one. Like your taste, your sight, your sound, touch, emotion, everything. It's like it melds into one giant entity, like one intangible entity that just exists in the space floating in the air. And at times it feels so good, it's like, it's like ecstasy. It is like the literal feeling of like orgasmic ecstasy. And then like five minutes later, I want to cry. I want to fall down on the ground and cry. It's like a physical feeling. It's like physically happening to me. It's not just a feeling in my head. It's like physical sensation, all the sensations, they just blend together, they're one, everything becomes one. <sighs> Trying to calm down, it's like over excitation. And I'm trying to sit still and it's not working very good, I'm trying really, really hard. I just want to walk around and I just want to pace the room and I just want to like touch everything. This is some of the stuff that was happening to me before I went into the hospital. <laughs> That's not me in there. And I know it freaks people out and luckily nobody is here right now because <laughs> they would be watching me.